of days after a, an interesting total knee. So um, Jane's ha had a patellectomy how many years ago? Um, uh, 37 years ago. So 37 years ago. And what we did, and I'll show you the x-rays in a second, um, but if you just lift the leg up in the air, show us your quads, and then bend it for us, Jane. So that's at 12 days and come out straight. And then how does it feel? It feels really comfortable. I'm thrilled with what I can do already. Um, having had everything corrected, I can, I can walk securely. My yeah. whole knee feels secure. The novelty of all the muscles starting to come alive and, and working in a different way yeah. and in the correct way. Um, not to mention, actually it might sound funny, is yeah. also being able to, to walk properly um, with, not, with a, a, a much narrower gait, with actually the novelty of walking walk with... Wide stance, yes, yeah. so I've always been walking wide stance for many and years. And how does it feel now you've got a kneecap? Because obviously we put one in. Yes, I, I can feel it now and yeah. it feels lovely. It yeah. feels, I mean, Excellent. just, I just want to sort of, like, you know, love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, we'll stop. The fact that I had bone on bone on the medial side and then um, a few months before I saw Professor Wilson, the lateral side went, so increased pain. I referred myself and I found him online. Initially he hoped that I could just have an osteotomy because I had an x-ray. Um, uh, when I first came up here. I then came up subsequently for an MRI and that revealed that there was just too much damage basically everywhere throughout the knee and compounded by the fact of not having an, a kneecap as well and, um, and I had uh, quite significant virus uh, which you know would have been corrected sort of by the osteotomy um, but as it was you know when I had the, the three-in-one op you know it was all done all in one. <laughs> remarkably straightforward considering just how complicated you know it um, it, 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 it was um, yeah very very straightforward in terms of what I felt immediately you know post-operatively actually good good I mean I, I wasn't in in pain um, uh, I think the the stiffness set in the following day which I you know I expected that's normal and natural um, you know, you don't get, you don't um, not get anything at all. But it, yeah, the, the immediately, yeah, very comfortable. And I just you know, made sure I got up out of bed and did what I could. You know, I got up that um, late afternoon after I came back from surgery. I got out of um, my the bed and sort of like you know walked to the loo with a with a with a frame. Then the very those first few hours. I had I had the knee replacement and the other two procedures done. It'll be six weeks tomorrow. It feels really good. It feels really good. I mean, what I'm able to do with my leg now, you know, is um, it's um, I, I can't compare it to what was happening, you know, just preoperatively, you know, and it's and I and I've I, I already have that feeling of expectation that it will just carry on getting better. <laughs> I want to say just marvellous and really beyond my expectations, yeah. Really, you know, for me, it has been out of this world because it has been so, you know, so life-changing. And, uh, yeah, and I just, I just, I feel very thankful and grateful and I feel very privileged as well, you know, that I've been given that opportunity, you know, through him and his team to, to really, you know, get myself physically, 
in you know in a in a really you know good position and I'm in my early 60s so you know it's it's certainly not over yet <laughs>